Greetings, I'm Rob Chappers. And I'm the captain. And welcome to the wondrous, wonderful land of Anderton's.co.uk. Led to my arms, my heart, my That's the one. Lee, um, yes. my words went strange because who's this? This is a special guest that we've got in for this particular performance today. Um, some might think that it's uh, David Lee Hoss, uh, but actually it's not. It's uh, it's Sammy Shergar. Oh. <laughs> and, uh, and anyway... Uh, and of course, little did uh, most of you know that actually uh, Sammy Shergar um, wrote uh, the, the the Van Halen classic "Jump" about the Grand National. What it is? <laughs> Might as well jump, jump. <laughs> Go ahead, jump, jump. Well, that's that isn't the biggest Sorry. load of horse shit, and I don't know <laughs> what is. But you so, know what's not horse shit, Lee? Tenuous link. What's not? This incredible guitar from Van Halen. Uh, oh, look at that. So last year, was it last year? I think it was last year. Um, EVH Guitars launched uh, a sort of a tribute to the striped red, white and black and the black and yellow and the black and white striped guitars that, that Van Halen used. And this is another one of the sort of iconic uh, graphics, if you like, that was on his, on his guitars. So the front of the guitars got kind of like a, a lady lying down with the head as her... Oh, uh, yeah, I just here. noticed that. And it's got like crop circles or something weird going on. Wait, is on he here. the first person to have on a naked lady in his guitar? Uh, probably not. And uh, then on the back. Oh, I don't tell on the back. Yeah. Okay. Because I wanted to show them the back at the end of the video. Sorry, cut that bit out there. No, it's fine. We'll okay, just we'll show it. Well, you have to wait and see, won't you? Yeah. So it's it's kind of like a hot rotted up strap with a, an EVH own brand pickup on it. I think it's a Wolfgang. It's humbucker. loads of fun. That's what it is. Shall, got... I, shall I show them what the pickups sound like? Yeah. So here's the bridge pickup. <laughs> Here's the neck pickup. Oh, I don't like There's that There's no neck pickup. Like the middle one? Let's middle wind one. it back a bit, though. She's a screamer. She plays great. So, uh, compound radius maple fretboard. So, yeah. uh, like a few of the guitars we've done today, a 12 inch at the this end, I think, goes up to about 16 inch. At this nice, end. easy bottom of neck Show chest me. adjustment uh, system. Ah, yes, very clever. We like that. Makes we'll a lot of sense. Hold the tool to um, make it better. Regular kind of machine heads, like you'd get on a you know a similar price sort of fender regular strat. Regular machine heads, um, but they but they're not regular because they see EVH they say, on them. Uh, uh, EVH. That's the mark uh, of quality. Because it takes Eddie ages to sign off his gear, doesn't it? I was speaking to... I, I, I must admit, I assumed that basically just Fender owned EVH and it was just some sort of... He was wrong! Time. Apparently not. Apparently EVH owns EVH. As yeah. In, you know, Mr. VH owns it. And uh, he has a sort of a licensing deal. So Fender build them and sell them, but only with his permission. And uh, apparently he is a real taskmaster when it comes to kind of signing stuff off. He, he absolutely wants to pick it all apart, make sure it's kind of exactly how he wanted it to be. Good for him, man. Yes, yeah, how it should be. It. It's worked um, hard. So what else? It. Show me the D-tuner, because I, okay. I know we've shown you that before, but you don't see this on many guitars. There's a the thing. At the bottom of the guitar here, it's called a D-tuner. It's on the trem system. You pull it out, and suddenly it's detuned to whatever you've programmed it to be tuned to, not programmed with digital codes yes, and binary you things. Set it to be, yeah. You set it to tune yes. to what, This is set to drop D, so currently it's in standard. <laughs> It works. Does that mean that the thing won't go back? No, it's grounded. So you can't put it back, but that gives it stability. If you're doing dual bends 
like in a kind of country fashion. So you, there's no up pull. <laughs> what gives it more stability in tuning? Because you can't, it doesn't pull up. Unless yes. you unless you really give it some heft on the bar, because I mean normally you can't pull back at all, can you? It's mechanically blocked from going backwards. But it's just resting on the body of the guitar. Let me see. So it's not possible. See, it's resting on the body of the guitar. Oh yeah. Yes. Yeah, I just... thought in I thought internally they've no, done no, no, something. No, they haven't. They of... haven't put a, a, a tremolo no on it. It's just it's resting on the body of the guitar, so you have to put some welly on it. Basically, the upshot being it's quite. This is the way Eddie had his tremolo. It's stable. If you've got to push on the body, you've got to push with a bit of energy for it to actually engage the right. tremolo. So if you want to do like. <laughs> Everything stays in tune nicely. If you want to use the trem, you've got to... The thing is, it means you've got to be really decisive yeah. about using, you can't do like subtle Steve Vai dips and dives. It's, it's like, I'm using a treble bar, yeah. now I'm not. But so it won't do that whole flatter thing or anything like that? No, nah, you just, just going like, to... It's, a, it's, a it's like I'm dive bombing and kind of, you know, and pushing yeah. quite hard to do that. Some will love, some will hate, but it's a thing. I personally, I would prefer that. I know I would prefer that because I've, I, you know. It means you can also detune. Yeah, it will make a it difference. Really so you, like, you can, like the drop D you can drop D fast, yeah. with the D tuner, and that's probably why it's been done. So it's a great guitar, maple. What's the body made from? Basswood. Basswood. We basswood agree, we agreed dreams. It was basswood, didn't we? Yes. You know what? I think it's time to show them the back of the guitar body. I would like to see the back of the guitar. I've been uh -huh. Chappers. I've been the captain. Take it easy, Chappers, and Cam out. Mm.